right, Mike? Oh, and by the way, you know what? I don't know if any of you have seen certain reality shows out there where, you know, the, the people think there's nothing in it for them, and then at the end of the show, they actually, you know, will get a million dollars or something, just like the surprise award. Oh, and since you did this, we're giving you a million dollars and a new house and all that? Well, that's not gonna happen to you, just so you know. Nothing in it for you, except making us happy. Just so you know, this is our disclaimer. Hold on just a second there, Neil. But I think you're wrong. <laughs> there is a way that they can actually get something from us. Wait, that is... get out! There's something for them, too? There is. Amazing. Here's what it is. First off, I think we have to introduce our new segment, Viewer Mail! Viewer Mail! Viewer Mail! Viewer Mail! Viewer Mail! Viewer mail! Boy, isn't it just great when you get a letter in the mail? Boy, and, you know, and these happen all the time in the days of snail mail. Now, this, these fast-paced kind of, you know, everything instantaneous, this email, this internet thing. People just don't get the snail mail anymore. But we think that getting a piece of letter, a piece of letter, or a piece of mail, the way that makes us happy. And it makes us even more happy if, if what, Mike? Well, look, imagine when you were a kid, okay? And it might have been something special for you, like your birthday, or maybe Christmas, or Easter, or I don't know, if you're a Catholic First Communion or something like that. And you'd get something in the mail from a distant relative that you didn't know all that well, but they always sent what? Money! 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 Money in the mail makes yes, you happy! Exactly! It does! It makes the happiness quotient go up no matter who you are, That's okay? That's right. Everybody likes to get money. And that's the problem with email is you really, really can't send money through email. Now, you can send electronic money transfer, and we'll talk about that later when we have more money and we're able to afford that sort of thing. But for right now, we're talking about the old school way of sending money, right? Through viewer mail. Watch it. Go ahead and pull some out of the mail bag there, Neil, and see what we got. Well, look, even though it's our first show, we have a piece of mail here. It's addressed to... Mike and Neil, The Happiness Workshop. So we'll get you that information soon, folks, so that you, too, can send us mail. And remember, no matter what you send, you can write us a letter if you'd like, but the main thing is that there's money, okay? And even a dollar is fine. Although, That's right. The widows might, you know? Wait a minute, we're, but what? We're not asking for millions. We're asking for whatever you want to send. But what, Mike? Is, you said there was something about money. Something was in it for them. Aside from, of course, making us happy, which is... Of course. Here's how it works, okay? Just in case you're concerned and you're wondering how that you can have happiness involved in this too. The person that sends us the most money every week will get exactly half of all the money we get. Yeah, that's exactly right. That's a right. promise we're making and if we'll have our lawyers swear to it off camera and everything else, okay? So how does that work? Let's say we got $80 in $1 bills. So 80 different people send us $1 bill each and we had $80 and then one person sent us a $20 bill, okay? Now, that one person would actually get $50 because that's half of the 100 total dollars that we got, right? And then Neil would get 25 and I would get 25. See, we're not greedy, all right? So you would be able to be happier if you send us more money than anybody else. <laughs> Exactly. So even though we'd be happy, thrilled really, if you sent us a dollar bill, remember, if you send us a $20 bill, you just might be the lucky winner and get more than your money back. And, and each week we'll say who, the next week we'll say who the person was from the winner from the week before and how much they won. And remember, think of it this way, because if maybe if you sent one dollar, or let's say you sent two dollars and everybody else sent a one dollar bill, okay, you might be the person that got sent the most money. And we might get, say, ten thousand dollars in one dollar bills and you would have sent two dollars and you would get what? Half of ten thousand dollars. Five thousand bucks. Five thousand bucks. So for a dollar you get five thousand back, maybe. But we're not remember. promising, we're just saying that's how that's going to work. Whoever sends us the most each week will get half of all of the money that we get. That's right, but remember, it's really not about the money. It's about the joy of making us happy. Why don't you open that letter there, Neil, and tell us what we got. All right, let's open this one up. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a letter from Westerville, Ohio. Westerville. Hey, Westerville. How Hi, you doing? Westerville. Love you. Love you. Okay, so... Uh... We're gonna get a band in here one day and we'll have some theme music. Okay. Oh, ho, ho, holy Mike, I can't believe it! Five dollars! We got that five dollars! Show them, show them five home. dollars! I feel, I feel great. Excellent. I feel wonderful. Five bucks. You know, some people, they're like, oh, five dollars. You know, to me, I am, I am really, really. I'm so happy. Well, one thing we know for sure, with this $5 bill, we know for a fact that someone's going to get $2.50 at least. At least. Someone out there is going to get at least $2.50 because they sent us a $5 bill. 
That's exactly right. Read the letter. What's the letter? Oh, let's it? take a look at this. Dear Mike and Neil, I'm not happy about your choice of profession. Please get a real job. Both of you. Signed, Mike's mom. Hmm. P.S. Here's five dollars. I hope you're happier now. We no, are we're happy. happier. You know, the first part of your letter had us. I don't know. I didn't Worry make you there, quite so mom. happy. But the five dollars did work. So we're just gonna take. You know what? You know, and this you can try this at home, folks, if if, if you want to. Don't don't hurt yourself. We wouldn't want to be sued. I'll be right back, Mike. You, you take over for a second. All, All right, right, let's go get a pen here. All right, he's gonna get a pen. Uh, this is. Neil getting a pen Here we and go. me watching him. See, right, our, our there's our other one camera. See, so we have two cameras, but we're, we're going to try to have three eventually if you send us enough of your money that we can afford that. The Happiness Workshop will be having a three camera shoot. That's right. Now, folks, suppose you get a letter like this, and I'll just read this first sentence again. D I'm not, dear Mike and Neil, I'm not happy about your choice of profession. See? See, now look. You right away, that. someone out there is not happy. Right away, we know that the happiness quotient is down a little yeah, bit. Yeah, my heart sinks a little at that. Feel bad. This Feel bad. negative energy there. We, we want to get rid of that. So listen, most people have access to a writing implement. This is called a pen. They're commonly found in pen stores. In Staples it's, pen stores. It's One of our soon-to-be sponsors. Staples. Staples. I don't know. Or Office or, Max. Yes. Say Office Max. Would you like us be mentioning Staples or Office Max. You know, if you send us your dollars, we could make that decision easier for you. Anyway, so here's the story. You find the pen or pencil at home. In fact, you could even use, you know, if you, if you couldn't afford this, you could maybe get a little burnt stick, you know, charcoal. Anyway, so all you do is you take the not happy, I just cross this out like so, and now it, the letter reads as follows. Dear Mike and Neil, I'm happy about your choice of profession. Boy, so I, see, by <laughs> sending us a letter with $5 in it and a little bit of editing on our part, the happiness quotient's gone up, right? That's right. I feel better already, Mike. I do too.